Hello and Happy New Year to you all and uh, I hope we have some excellent golfing weather this season and it yields lots of birdies for all. Looking out the window today it's absolutely pouring down the rain so today is a good day for me to continue my winter practice drills and part three of the four part, four part series is working on correct posture. As I say this is something you can do indoors on days like today or in the evening when you can't get out to hit golf balls. Working on good solid fundamentals is extremely important and you're practicing getting the feeling of what's correct so you can take that feeling to the golf course. So good posture is where we have the spine straight, tilting over from the hips and then to support that leaning forward we put a bit of bend in the knees to get the weight balanced on the balls of our feet. If I'm checking posture I'd like to see a straight line down from just the backs of the shoulders will run through the kneecap and into the balls of the feet. That tell us, telling us that we've got the correct mm -hmm. angles, correct weight distribution. You can feel that yourself if you rock back and forth from toes to heels and still maintaining good balance tells you that you've created a stable foundation with good angles in your posture. A drill I use to get encourage people to practice that is to get the club Cross your back there, get your spine nice and straight to the golf club, set your normal seven iron stance, tilt over from the hips, okay, keeping the legs straight, and as I say, bend the knees to get the weight on the balls of the feet, keeping that back nice and straight to the club, and chin up. There you can see good angles. Bring the club round, and make your grip to get the feel of what it would be like to an actual golfer. Practice that in front of a patio door, or mirror to see yourself do that and get the feeling. Taking good posture out of the golf course is def definitely going to help you with your shots and improve those scores. Thank you very much and speak to you all next week.